What's up you guys? Welcome back to another video. If you don't know already, my name's Kathy. I do weekly vlogs, so I hope you watch it, stick around and enjoy. If you don't already know or saw the last video right here, um, we took Ranger, which is my best friend's dog. We took him out on the boat for the first time and it was Mike's first time going on the boat. I really enjoyed myself, if you couldn't already tell. Um, so we did that last week. So that was, that took up, that took up like the whole day. Originally I had it to wear last week uh, me and everyone were going to shoot the short film, but with everything going on, and I didn't want to miss out on the boat, I'm gonna be honest with you, uh, I, I decided to opt it out for this week. I have pretty much everything set up for it already. The main thing I need to focus on right now is how the set is gonna look like. So that studio that you always, not always, but like sometimes see me in. Every, everywhere else is kind of already set. It's just um, the only thing that needs any kind of set, set production sort of thing is that studio so um today i have to draw drawings that are going to be shot um because that's a part of the plot of the film um i have to do some drawings three of them to be precise picking out what classes i need for the next semester because school's kind of starting to ramp up again um i need to watch some films take some notes uh just do that really the short film is the number one thing that i want to get out of the way this week so I'm gonna start drawing right now. So see you guys in the next clip. I don't know when that'll be, but see you guys in the next clip. Well, I already started it a little bit right now, but I figured I'd, cause I don't really have any idea how this is. Well, I have some idea, but. This is gonna take a lot of brainstorming, so I'm just going to wrap it up and show you guys the after. Mmm, don't like that. Ta da! I made it a little bit more sim simpler with just the head so that it'd be easier. I wanted to make this crunchy look. I used the uh, part of a kneaded eraser and then just uh, picked up uh, charcoal shavings. And then this one's still not done yet. So I have to fill in the head and stuff, but I wanted to add more squiggles since this is the last one. It's the next day. As you guys see, I had breakfast. Um, I'm getting everything ready for the shoot today, tonight. Uh, and I'm gonna show you guys. All right, a lot of stuff to unpack here. I have this little checklist I have. This cute little Japanese notebook. 
I still need a boat today, so I gotta make time for that too. I'm charging all my lights that I think I'll be using. So the, these ones I got from Best Buy, these are really cool because um, they can stack on top of one another like that. So that, I really like that feature. So I got two of them, um, both charging right now, as you can see. The light I use most often and um, my most well-used light, Roleno, really good light and uh, lasts for a long time. And it tells me how many Kelvins it's on and it tells me what the charging is on. Uh, it's almost done. This is what the little power station is looking like right now. We have the Rolano light, the two other lights, and um, actually no, this is my phone, the two other lights and the camera battery. Probably not safe to do that, but I have lenses I'm gonna use. I have my 50 used for portraits and stuff for the close-ups. I have my 35 to 70. I have two of these. I have one on my camera already, and this is the kit lens that came with it. Um, a lot of people talk shit about kit lenses, but I think uh, for what it is, I think it's decent. And I think it's good for a beginner that doesn't know what they're doing, so. What else? These things right here, like, diffuse and reflect light. So they're just really big. I, when I first bought them, I wasn't expecting them to be that big. Like this whole bed big. I have my makeup. Right, so the wig cap, I have a little ears that I'm gonna stick onto them. I have a spirit gum, which is used as an adhesive. I have a um, really popular makeup brand, Paradise is what all the big cosplayers use and stuff. It's water-based. This is, along with this one, these two are alcohol-based, so I had them already, so might as well use them. That's why I didn't buy a white one of this. Hopefully I don't regret it, um, but I'm gonna try to use them both together and see how that comes out. This is glycerin. Um, it's used for baking. I'm not exactly sure what you would use it for baking for, but this is what I'm gonna use to make the mixture for um, fake sweat. The way a lot of film sets and things, makeup sets used for fake sweat. Well, we can't use actual sweat because we have to do multiple takes. So if you mix this with water, it, it, the sweat can go a long way. And um, the more of this you use to it, the more, um, the varying degrees you can get and how the sweat looks and everything. Of course, I have some gaffer tape. Um, this one's running out though. I need to get like more tapes to use on set and stuff. I need a lot of things for, I'm not too big on production just cause it makes me anxious. <laughs> There's like so many things to prepare for. I have my slate here. I'm excited to use it for the first time. I need to find some expo markers. There's so much stuff I need to prepare for, but um, I'll check back with you guys later. Yeah. Hey guys, I just wanted to record this outro really quick. Um, before you go, go check out my friend Jordan's new podcast. Um, he's had a lot of people on already. He's been doing it for about a month. I'm on the second episode, so if you're interested in me and what I have to say, go check that out. He's on a bunch of platforms, and that's about it. Go click the like button, subscribe. 
Um, click the notification button to get notified and go vote. Go ahead and see ya. But don't judge yourself. Look at your actions up until this point. Think of your character. Think of your integrity, integrity up until this point.